Hi everyone, welcome back to Comic Kinky. Today will be a quick hair update and I wanted to do this video now because I'm getting ready to start the process of washing my hair. And I say start the process because I never just go straight to washing. I typically do some type of pre-poo or hot oil treatment, etc. Et before I wash my hair. So I've had my hair straightened for about four weeks now. I'll be sure to insert pictures. I probably probably already put some in, but if I didn't, in the beginning, I will have some after this clip is done. But I did have my hair, I've had my hair like this for four weeks. I've been able to maintain um, my hair for the most part using flexi rods, doing pin curls, or just by simply grabbing my hair like this and putting it in a bun in the back. And that kind of has helped maintain the curls. When I want to tie a curl, I use a smaller flexi rod or I curl the hair or I wrap the hair more tightly. If I want it looser, then I do larger sections of hair with bigger flexi rods and they'll it'll yield like a um, much looser curl. I've been wearing a deep side part and kind of flipping the bang back and forth depending on what I feel like doing that particular day. I've really been liking my um, hair straighten. There was a time time in my life where I didn't really want my hair straight, but lately I've actually really enjoyed this four weeks of straight hair. It's been so easy. It's literally get up and go. At night, I've been wearing a, sat a satin slash silk scarf, and I always do that whether my hair is um, in its curly state or in its um, flat iron state. I also wear a shower cap before I get in the shower, so I wrap my hair in the satin scarf and then I put the shower cap on top and I do that every night and I haven't had much of a problem with keep maintaining my hair. My edges are starting to get a little bit more fuzzy but for the most part my hair has stayed straight. It's very very soft even though it's time to be washed. It is very very soft. You guys can see it has grown some since the last um, time I had my hair straightened which was back in July. And so I'm really happy with the progress that my hair has made in the six months um, in between um, me getting it straightened. I did decide to take measurements this time because I'm very forgetful. And to me, sometimes when you look at pictures, it's like you think your hair is grown, but you really can't tell in six months. And so I did decide to take hair measurements, which I'll share with you guys. The left front side near my ear, so I literally mean the, the hair right behind the ear here. This part right here is, um, this measured at 12 inches, okay? And then the right front, which is literally like, I took the hair from here um, and pulled it all the way down. As you guys can see, this hair, this piece is longer than that piece. This came in at 15. Um, the left side, same section came in at 15 as well. But then the right side behind my ear over here, was a little bit longer than the piece over here. This piece measured 12 inches, this one measured 13 inches, and then my bangs, so when I take the hair in the very front and pull it down, that's coming in at 14 inches. That's that's pretty much all the measurements I did, and then I did the crown of my head, and the crown of my head measures in at 15 inches as well. So my hair is pretty even on both sides, or whatever. So my layers have definitely grown out, because most of my hair is between 12 and 15 inches, 12 being the shortest length that I was able to find. And to measure the back, I just kind of did like this over my shoulder. And this is about 15 inches. And so now that I have some measurements um, to work with, I'll be able to track more objectively how my hair is flourishing, if I'm retaining length, because your hair is always going to grow, right? So it's going to grow, but it's really, am I retaining the length um, as it grows out? So I definitely am trying to grow my hair out. I want to be below bra strap length like I was previously. That is my hair goal. So I'm going to do whatever I, it takes to get there. And really, I don't do a lot. I think that if you moisturize your hair, you protect the style when you need to limit the amount of heat, tension, and extra stuff that you're doing to your hair, and you're massaging your scalp and keeping it clean, that your hair is going to naturally thrive. I don't use a ton of different products. I don't buy... Everything that's on the market that's targeted at curly girls or natural girls. I keep my routine simple. I get my ends trimmed. I've been trying to go every three months, but that hasn't always happened. But this year, or as of 2016, I did a really good job keeping up with my trims. And I got my hair trimmed 
December 28th, right when I got my hair um, flat ironed. So what I'll do now is, um, what I'll do now is try to keep up with this schedule, a three month schedule of getting my hair trimmed. So since I went at the end of December, I'll be trying to go back, what is that, March? Yeah, so sometime in March, early April, I'll probably go back to my stylist um, and get my hair stretched and then trimmed. I probably won't get a flat iron again, but I'll make sure that she stretches it and then just gives me a light trim as needed. But I definitely want to keep up with my trims. I want to keep my ends healthy to limit breakage and all of that. But so far, so good. My edges look great. They are a little fuzzy right now because my hair is trying to go revert back. It was really humid today and rainy, and I can tell that my ends are starting to get frizzy. So I'm going to go ahead and do a clay treatment on my hair. I'm going to deeply moisturize it. Um, clarify my scalp and do all of the whole routine and then I'll come back at some point I probably will insert a picture or just do a video tomorrow showing you guys what my hair looks like after I washed it out from being straight so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions please leave them below as always you can keep up with me at callmekinky.wordpress.com until next time peace love and prosperity